hello everyone welcome back to my channel today i'll be showing you how i make my gist dodo are you a lover of gist dodo like i am if you are or you're not just stay tuned and watch if you're new to my channel please like please subscribe and if you want to get notified press the bell button my name is kosoli chipel okabwe i am a food blogger and i live in abuja nigeria So here are my ingredients that I'll be using to make this gish dodo. I'll go further to show you all the ingredients accordingly. Keep watching. Okay, I have my gizzard nicely chopped. Then I have my plantain, ripe plantain. Then I have my tomato, my onion, my pepper and tatashe. Then I have my red bell pepper, my green pepper my carrots and my peas i'm so excited then i have my vegetable oil yeah my salt my seasoning cubes my curry and my thyme keep watching well for me the first thing i love to do is to cut my plantain and dice it but you can choose to make your gizzard first anyhow you want it i just want to cut it dice it and let it just keep it one side you know so it could just be soft because when you cut plantain and keep it it becomes very soft and when you're eating it oh the sweetness As you can see my plantain is diced nicely and then I'll set it aside and prepare my vegetables <laughs> okay so I'm gonna prepare my veggies you know chop 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 yeah keep chopping so my veggies has been nicely chopped so the next thing I'll be doing now is to prepare my gizzard. Oh, this gizzard looks so beautiful. <laughs> Sorry, but can't you see? So first and first, I'll have to spice my gizzard. I'll be using my no cube, my curry, my thyme, my salt. What else? What else? What else? That's just it. Yeah. And when I'm done spicing my gizzard, I'll just have to cover it. Guess what? I'm not going to put water. No, you don't need to put water. You would see the water that will come out of this gizzard. Keep watching, guys. Okay, wait a second. Do you all actually think... I was gonna miss putting my onion now my onion goes in onion gives you the sweetness so as you can see my gizzard naturally brings out water my gizzard is ready and then the next thing I'll be doing is to fry it So, fry, 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 fry. Just keep frying. Hola, my gizzard is fried, and I have to bring it out. 
and then I have to fry my dough dough. Keep watching. Sorry, I won't be showing you the aftermath of my fried dodo. Not until I'm frying it with my gizzard. So I'll be blending my tomato, onion, and pepper, and then I'll go over to frying it in the pot and then spicing it. Okay, so the next thing goes. Um, oops, did I? I just actually forgot to let you know that I put my gizzard stock in. Oh, sorry, guys. Please put your gizzard stock to make the sauce sweet. So I have to add my seasonings. I'll start with my seasoning cubes, my salt, my curry, and my thyme. You can choose to put anything, but I just like it mild. So I didn't bother to put other things. But just curry thyme, salt, and seasoning cube. Yeah. What time is it? It's time to put my dodo and my geyser and then fry it into the sauce. And my geyser will be ready. Oh, can't you see? This is so beautiful. I hope you try this at home. I hope you try this. If you're not a Giz Dodo fan, please just try it and see. I'm sure you love it. Mm. Can you see? Now my veggies goes in. And then I have to turn it and turn it and turn it and then serve it and then eat it. Today must be my lucky day because I'm so happy. Yeah, I love Gizzard and Dodo. So that's why I'm happy. So as you can see, my geese dodo is ready. I hope you try this at home. I hope you like. I hope you subscribe. I hope you share with friends. I hope you I hope you just love my video. <laughs> and I hope you keep watching because I have much and better content to showcase. Oh, this gizzard is something else. I can't wait to get my fork and dig inside and then have it with a cup of cheese. Thank you guys for watching. Bye bye.